Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, I'm filming this on my iPad, so the lighting's probably weird because it's like, it's so bright outside and it's so annoying. Um, but I lost one of my memory cards to my camera. I think, well, I don't think I did. I think one of my children did. And I decided not to like put a cute shirt yeah. on or anything for this Chocolate. video just because I'm going to be answering questions that you guys me that are embarrassing. Okay, so I'm going to be answering questions that you guys asked me. Um, I had a few people message me and say like, hey, can you make a video on um, like embarrassing pregnancy symptoms and stuff like that? And I was like, you know what? Like, why don't I just make a video of like answering like your most like curious questions like I, like I posted on Instagram and a few other places and said like ask me anything so and these are all gonna be anonymous per request because <laughs> some of these are embarrassing and um, some of these are a little inappropriate so if you're my mother or my father please stop watching okay so I had a few people ask <laughs> some of the like weirdest questions but um I had like four of these questions so I'm just gonna answer it all together um people asked me if like breaking out and like having like greasy hair and like sweating like if that's normal like I don't know if you guys can tell but like my face is not the prettiest and my hair I mean it's not like it's not greasy it might look gross but it's not like it's not greasy, but um, that's all normal. It's totally normal and it's totally okay. Don't freak out. Don't freak out if you get pimples. Don't freak out if you, you know, like, like if your hair gets like either dull or greasy, like that's so normal because if you think about it, you have so many hormones pumping through your body right now, even more than when you get your period. Cause I know some women even a couple of my friends, when they get their period, they get like, like weird, like hair Mommy, problems, like I, just around I, their period. I, it's all totally normal. Let's see. <laughs> Have I had any <laughs> embarrassing pregnancy symptoms? Yes. Oh my gosh. Yes. And I'm gonna I'm gonna combine a lot of these questions because they're the, a lot of them are like the same. Um, and if you guys didn't know, a lot of my friends on a certain Facebook group asked me this because I am in school right now to be a doula. So a lot of my friends were like, "Hey, like make a YouTube video like answering these questions." So that's another reason. But um, is bloating and gas normal? Yes, so normal, and it's nothing to be embarrassed about. We're human and we're growing a human inside of us. That's a lot of work. It's completely normal, especially because when you're pregnant, if you think about it, like your belly, uh, the bigger you get, everything gets like smushed together. So of course you're gonna fart and burp and you know, like that's so normal and it happens to every single pregnant woman. I bet you a thousand dollars that every single pregnant woman out there has experienced gas and bloating and all of that. And if they tell you they haven't, they're lying. They are lying to you because ev it's so, so normal. So normal. And don't, <laughs> I shouldn't have to say this, but I'm going to, do not try and hold it in. You will get stomach cramps. Do not do that. <laughs> Let's see. Leaky breasts, yes. That is another normal pregnancy symptom. But yes, um, leaky breasts, that's super normal. Especially, I've actually found, now that this is my, now that this is my third baby, I have realized that, I mean, your body kind of knows what to do. So, my boobs this pregnancy are a lot bigger than they were with Liam and with Jackson because I've breastfed two babies now and this will be a third. Third, yep, that's that's three. Third, <laughs> and my boobs, I have woken up already with like wet spots on my shirt or like 
I've seen like milk come out and you know my husband will look at me and be like you all right there like you haven't breastfed in over a year and I'm like nope it's normal completely normal completely 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 normal if you have any concerns about anything we're gonna talk about in this video talk to your doctor because I'm not a medical professional so if you think that like there might be something else going on talk to your doctor but leaky breasts totally normal it's annoying but it's normal and it gets worse when you when the baby actually comes out a lot worse pick it up diarrhea or constipation yes so diarrhea is super common when you're pregnant and so is constipation just because of all the hormones it's really annoying but unfortunately it's common um actually diarrhea towards the end of your pregnancy around if like diarrhea starts around like 38 weeks 39 weeks that's actually a really good sign that means that your body's getting ready to give birth and that could be a sign of labor it's it's super common nothing to be freaked out about so don't think if you have diarrhea early in your pregnancy you're like oh my gosh i'm going into labor because i'm 17 almost 18 weeks i've had diarrhea a few times now it's not fun it's not fun at all and it's <laughs> It's just one of those like normal symptoms. It's just, it's normal and it sucks. Have I had vaginal discharge? Okay, this is a huge one. I actually got this question a lot, which is surprising because I mean, we're all women, so I'm just gonna talk about it anyway. But <clears throat> even when I'm not pregnant, I, you know, get vaginal discharge. Every woman should, it's just your body like cleansing, you know, like your vagina cleaning itself super normal now when you're pregnant again because of the hormones lovely lovely hormones it increases and that's normal i have had a lot that i've actually worn like a pad a few times just because i don't want to like be sitting in my own discharge all day it's not fun it's nothing to be embarrassed about every single pregnancy symptom we're going to go over in this video sorry i thought i saw a spider <laughs> is completely normal and if and, do not feel embarrassed and don't let anyone else make you feel embarrassed. If somebody looks at you and goes like, ew, gross, like, especially if it's a woman, they've had it. They've had it. Don't let them fool you. And if it's a man, tell them to fuck off, honestly, because it's, it's completely normal. And it's, it's just your way, your body's way of creating a human. You're literally growing a human inside of you. Cut yourself some slack. Is it normal if if I pee myself? Yes, that is so normal. Um, so for the women like me who have had kids already, your bladder probably isn't the strongest. Um, I know if I like sneeze or like laugh really hard, I will pee, like a little pee will come out. Um, this pregnancy, <laughs> this pregnancy, um, I was throwing up, guys, I've thrown up a lot this pregnancy. But I had to, it was one of those times it just came out of nowhere. I was literally mid, like mid conversation with my husband, ran to the bathroom and puked. While I was puking because it was so forceful, I peed and I cried. And Steve came in, he was like, babe, what's wrong? Why are you crying? Are you okay? And I was like, I just peed my pants and I threw up. And he was like, oh my gosh, so what? He, I have the greatest husband. He took my clothes, put them in the wash. He was like, babe, take a bath, take a shower. You're fine. It's normal. And I was like, you're right. It is normal. Nothing I should be ashamed about. No. Why are you crying? Excuse you. Because I miss you. Oh. I'm right here. Hey, go eat lunch. Hey, keep your teeth to yourself. No bite. Say you're sorry to your brother. No. That's not nice. Say you're sorry to your brother. Hey, come here. Why are you biting? Why are you biting? Huh? Dude. <laughs> but anyway, yes, uh, peeing yourself is normal and it'll happen even after you're pregnant, unfortunately. Sorry to tell you. But it's normal, so you're not alone. 
I feel like I'm the only pregnant woman with no desire for sex. No, that that's very normal. Again, hormones. Hormones do lovely, lovely things to us women. And it's super normal to not want sex. And it's also super normal to constantly want sex. And I know some of you are probably like, oh my God, she's talking about this in front of her kids. My kids don't know what I'm talking about. Liam is going to be four. He doesn't know what I'm talking about. Jackson is two. He doesn't know what the fuck I'm talking about. I should not be cursing in front of them though, so I'm gonna stop that. But um, yeah, super normal. Again, hormones. So hey, stop throwing things. So if you don't feel like getting down and dirty with your husband or your significant other right now, just tell them, just say, hey, I'm not in the mood. No one is gonna feel sexy when they're like throwing up or being super nauseous all the time. No one is gonna feel sexy. So don't feel bad, don't feel guilty. It's normal. And if you have a good partner, they will completely understand. I mean, Steve and I went almost like the first month of my pregnancy without touching each other because I was so nauseous. I was constantly throwing up. It was horrible. Now I'm in the second trimester. I'm starting to get the drive back, but it was, it was awful. And it's normal. Don't feel bad. This is also one that I've gotten like three times. Um, I don't want to poop while pushing my baby out. Any suggestions? I've never had a vaginal delivery, so I can't answer like personal, but I mean, who cares? I know like you're probably thinking about that right now and you're going to be embarrassed because no one, like, you don't want anyone to see poop, but honestly, like you're pushing you're pushing a damn baby out like it's fine if you poop it's perfectly normal like don't do not feel bad do not feel guilty it's completely normal completely oh one more bleeding gums um i actually haven't had that symptom ever like bleeding gums my teeth hey give me that give me that right now my teeth have hurt before because, and I know that that's normal. It's just, um, you know, like everything in your body kind of like relaxes when you're pregnant, like all your like muscles. And stuff. All right, guys, sorry about that. We're gonna have to end the video here. <laughs> we have cranky babies in the house today. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I'm sorry if you can't hear me right now. I know it's not ideal because my son is crying because he's cranky and his brother just bit him. We're in the biting stage again. So, um, thank you guys so much for watching. <laughs> Again, I'm sorry about that. If you guys have any more questions, leave them down below. Or I'll leave my socials. You can private message me on Instagram or Facebook or Twitter, anything. And I will answer any of your questions also. Anyway, um, I will leave my socials down below. You guys can ask me any questions. I am going to school to be a doula. So, if you guys have any questions about that, I will answer them. Um, I will see you guys next time. Thank you so much for watching. And have a good day.